with the ball here first. Conference play is underway at East Lansing, and the ball hall just offset a little bit. And their play action, and there's Braxton's running ability that Herbie referred to. Now the center takes over, and Herbie's going to get in and tell you that story as they run Jordan Hall. Ori Lindsley is the Buckeye center. Miller eludes traffic. Bullet chasing on the other side. Guys, big passing opportunity for Braxton. Fires, got the first down, and... Boom. And he kept it beautifully. He's a fine ball handler. Uh, Kenny Guyton comes on here to run the Buckeye offense. And this is Jordan Hall. Five and first down. It'll be and they're going tempo here. And so here they come. And the big group. And it's clear that Urban wants Kenny Guyton to stay in. And over the top for the touchdown. Jordan Hall. And then he takes it up and into the end zone. Ohio State on the road. That's exciting. This is Drew Basil. And he adds the extra point. Different look to their attack this year. Basil likes to get this one down right about the goal line. And Hill will bring it out. Hill, fine return. Now a couple of tight ends on this opening series. Going to run to the right and nothing doing it. That is big. He would be your left defensive tackle if he could get a push. Maxwell rolls. Fires to the sideline, a fine game. Here's a formation we didn't see. The screen set up with Bell to the left, the bunch. They, uh, Spartans did not. Goes deep, in zone, over through his man, and it was almost intercepted. And it leaves the Spartans with a second and ten, but they're going to keep it airborne. Drop it to Bell. Bell to the looks. But they're keeping the ball in Bell's hands on the swing pass. Comes in motion behind. He'll lead Bell on this play. And the Buckeyes read it perfectly. As they try, they have spread the field as they do right here again. And in troubles Maxwell. Running to his right has to throw this ball to board. Slides it through. So here's the kickoff by the Spartans, and the Buckeyes will. And now Braxton Miller is back, and that's a good sight. And here is Corey or Philly Brown with the reception. So we'll keep an eye, Heather, with four down linemen. Fuller steps into the middle. Fumble, and the Buckeyes recover it. Third down and short. And here comes Braxton Miller keeping it for the first down with that wonderful running ability. He's finally... Braxton Miller's one of the best running backs in the country. And you are absolutely right. Here he is looking to pass it now. Did he throw it too far? Incomplete. They could suck it down and 10 for the Buckeyes. And now it'll be third down as they motions out. So from an empty look and a quick fire almost intercepted. About... A punt was blocked for a touchdown. Buchanan and the Spartans are content to see what they can do. Hill with a big bounce, fields it and takes a blow. And there come the penalty flags. Personal foul, unnecessary roughness. Kicking team number 34, hit above the shoulder. 15 yards from the end of the kick. Automatic first down. That's what they call it. You know, he's clearing his hands. He's not indicating anything about a fair catch, regardless if it's a fair catch. Yeah, you can't so it's like a, that. that's a no-brainer. you got to make that call. Yeah, there's no question. 7-3 here, 5-30. They'll come out for the 25 after the penalty, and they pound behind the left side of the line. And Thomas is back in as the lead back for Bell. He clears the way, and again, with a performance like that, Third down, and Maxwell snaps it off to Paul Lang. Taking up coverage to not give up those easy throws underneath. Everybody moved with the football. Offense. Thought it was Five one of those penalty. dummy plays where they down. watch him in practice, Heather. He's got a very smooth delivery like that yeah, right yeah. there. And now some confidence, even though he does trail by four, didn't get the ball in the end zone. Moving the pocket to the left. Firing this time, and almost a beautiful catch. Let's credit the Buckeye defense. That was very well covered. So now on third down, going to throw in underneath, and that's short of the first down. So it looks like Jordan Hall 
has come back deep. Or is that Travis Howard? Georgia Hall got the carry, and that play with Hart went to the same high school as he did. They got a little bit of a duel. Who could get to the quarterback the most? And this time, nobody's getting to Braxton, and he scampers proud of this crossover dribble here on Isaiah Lewis in the open field. Did he? Right there. Open field, a really, really good safety, very aggressive. Golston trying to get around Newhart, unable to, to un unable to, but that gives you an option. Said to say hello to you. Love Third it. down and three, fires it over the middle. That's going to be short of the first down. Nick Hill back there returning the punt. He did not return punts against Eastern Michigan last week. Bell did. And now he feels the punt, which is what they want him to do. And get. And it's a good duel up front in this game so far. As they set the screen, here is Bell. That's his fifth reception, I believe, of the game. game but the dogs better beware. Tennessee thinking upset today. Downfield. Maxwell going to go long and incomplete. Michigan State had a lineman downfield. downfield. Offense number 70. The penalties declined. Third down. Incomplete and again punted. And Corey Brown will be back and he'll let this one go into the end zone. We're football game broadcast on that Saturday afternoon. That's right. That's how it was back in the 70s. And Hyde, who has checked in on that play. So now we've got second down and 10. And here comes Braxton keeping it again. And Herbie, the ones ahead, is a jet sweep. The Percy Harvin, if you will, coming through the formation. Braxton keeps it, fires complete. Down the sideline. That for the blitz. Bullock gets through, flushes into his left. A great job of keeping his eyes poised. Nice job of locating Brown. Good location by the football and outstanding concentration by Brown to get the toe down inbounds for the first down. Critical him in his passing game. Review, the ruling on the field is confirmed. A catch at the sideline, first down. He missed two games with the knee injury. Now he's got the option with Hyde, keeps it on a sharp cut. Picks up about Braxton and the defense. Throwing wide open on the side to Devin Smith for a first down. Devin to the quick throw. Calhoun has replaced Golston in that defensive front. And they snap it out to Brown. Again. Jordan Hall back on the field. There's that read option. And Miller. Braxton Miller has rushed for 73 yards. Now comes back and it's intercepted. Picked off by Drummond. Exception came on a first down play by the Buckeyes. And here comes Bell for a couple of yards. And we go against the middle of that Buckeye front. And that is Caper, Larry King. He'll get down right over the nose this time. And Maxwell to throw it out quickly. And it's right at the mark. Coming back with the running back, Bell. And Bell is the Spartans so far here today. He's on the right side of the formation. Play action. Gets it off incomplete in the re motion to the left side of the formation. They'll run in that direction behind Sims for a first down, but there's a penalty. Holding. Offense number 70. 10 yards from the previous spot. Repeat third down. Steps up. Fires Mumphrey over there. Crowd wanted exception. The Spartans can't move. They'll have to punt it back. And Jordan Hall. Ooh, it's over his head. He's in a foot race on the hop at the four. Trying to get back downfield, and he is finally. What a good sign that is. Number two. And there's the pitch to Hall for the Buckeyes. All at the 25 yard line for Braxton and the Buckeyes. And they can't find much. Second down and eight. Braxton is sacked at the 20 yard 14 yards on this pass in trouble Norman on him again but Braxton slips it and to Jordan Hall was short and leaves him with a four yard situation on fourth down so they'll punt it away with Ben Buchanan and Hill will let this one 
Roll down just across the 30 yard line. Well, it was kind of fascinating. I saw the Big Ten release and I thought, well, let's, let's go with it. And as Bell to the 30, as we watched him for a while, Herbie, it did look like a basketball game with a scoreboard. First down, Pat, make the plays in order to be able to be successful. Dan Rusher calling the plays. Maxwell, then that one was just a touch high. Second down and 10. They'll toss the Bell. And he can't get the edge. And their chops here on third and nine. Maxwell, and that one should have been caught by Mumphrey. I pulled Michigan State. Ball's thrown on the money. You've got to secure that football right there. Get ready. You're going to get yeah, hit. That's, that's just part of it. Bryant came in well after the ball was already through his hand. That's a killer. Yeah, that's because a first down. Because you've given the ball back to your opponent with two and a half minutes to go in the half. Your Devin Smith is back deep for the Buckeyes. But and so the Buckeyes roll in with Roby, swallow Utah or Florida. Players work hard to get on this unit. He came from the outside, but it was a jailbreak. They were all coming. They pinned their ears back, and that is a great effort by the corner, starting cornerback, Roby. Corner for the Buckeyes. Option he'll cut away. He almost that bullet gives him an odd look. And Braxton is run down by Golston. He fumbles, and the Spartans come up with it. Goes down and 10. That's the calmest I've ever seen Urban Meyer on a turnover. For the most part, pretty well here. Let's see if they can hold on to the ball. He's going to go middle again, and Sims for the first is spread. Keeps it in the air, and I'll tell you, down and 10. Maxwell back again, fires complete right in the middle of the field. That's what they want to First down to Long Lake and Conroy. And that's incomplete. They have more. Back again, pump fake. Steps up, got a wide open man, and that's a bad throw. Ten. And he has to throw it away. It was first drive. This one looks like it's off to the right. No good. Right. Continue to mount here this afternoon. Hyde is on the right side of Braxton Miller. And a juggling. At the six yard line is Hill. And he's shy of the pair of tight ends. And I back to Bell. And Bell runs right behind the middle of the offensive line, and there's it nothing not doing. Bell oh. behind the right side, and that leaves him in three and six for Maxwell and the Spartans. Under pressure, incomplete, and there's a penalty flag as the... Holy, defense number one. Ten yards from the previous spot. Automatic. As the fullback directly behind Maxwell. Bell tries to get the left edge, and he can't do it. Jammed up. On second and nine. Maxwell, and under. That's a bad, bad non-call, and John's a very good referee. Fire wide open. Got it complete to Benny Fowler. Fowler brought there, recognized. Receiver coming into your area. 35-yard gain. Back to the middle they go. And that is Big Sims. With a 14 by the gain. And because of the team. Releasing out of the backfield is Bell. And be able to have a chance of slowing him down. Second down and 10. Deep drop. Maxwell drops it off to Sims. Incomplete. The way the Spartan defense are playing, if this is four downs, this is third down first, and fires incomplete, and one is harder, and missed from 42. So here we come. Conroy looks like he's got the distance on this one. And that strong leg of Muma, and he's one who's split out right now. Braxton. After faking the run, fires to Brown, and that didn't fit who missed a couple of games. Braxton keeping this all the way. This ran simply to daylight. And Braxton on a cutback. 
And oh, Bullock came hard on that tackle. Stayed upstairs today. Braxton, play action. Brown, first down to the 42 yard. Personal foul, hands to the face. Defense number two. That penalty is declined. Result of the play is the first down. No pressure on Braxton. Dances away now to the right side. And Bullock finally to side linebacker. And here's Brown on the outside, and he's short of the first down. Ooh, and the quarterback keeps it himself, and here he comes. He's got the first down for Ohio State. There's Hyde, and Hyde, we will see. Miller keeps it, slips the first tackler, and makes it right to him. What a perfect snap. Braxton looking back across the field and throws it away. Out of Youngstown is the center. Pocket holds, but it's deflected. Came back the inside. They're not going to get there. This is a 26-yarder. Pulled it to the left. But now I feel good. Hill 20 with a scene. Look. And Bell picks it up now for a lot time. Play action. They're gonna throw out of it this time to Sims. And they've got a first down. Personal foul. Face man. Defense number one. 15 yards from the end of the run. Automatic first down. Teams back there. From the 29-yard line, a play-action rollout pass. A beautiful move, and Mumphrey still going to the end zone. Touchdown! Need for that touchdown. So, and this time it will be returned by Smith. He shakes a tackler and returns out in the end and couldn't bring him down. So it's first down and 10, and Braxton Miller is now chased out of the pocket, throws high and complete. Braxton with the lead play to Hyde, and Hyde is short of the first down. Down of the game, they haven't reached the end zone since. This time, Braxton Miller. On first down, Braxton looks to the sideline. Beautiful throw and a touchdown. Devin Smith. Buckeyes back up by four. Necessarily a fancy route, but it's speed against experience. Devin Smith, who runs a 10-4 in the 100 out of Maslin, goes right by Johnny Adams, who's from Akron. These two guys played against each other, know each other very well from when they're in their younger days. And Devin Smith was looking forward to this matchup, and so was Johnny Adams. But he didn't jam him at the line of scrimmage and slow him down. And that throw gives you an idea of what... ...and the Buckeyes. Here comes Hill. Had a good return the last time. This time, too. At the 31 game. That would be an impressive win after the emotional loss last week. So the end around does not work. Nick linebacker from the right side. Watch him time this up perfectly. I mean, he, he knew exactly what was coming. Watch this right here at the end. Boom. Big hit. Shazier, the most experienced. Expecting a pass from Maxwell, and he doesn't disappoint. In underneath. And that's the young man who struck a few moments. Three wide. Mumphrey's to his right. Does not look in that direction. He's going the left all the way. And it is complete. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> Play action again. Throwing on first down. Looking back to that far side. Deflected. Incomplete. Look at it. Now here comes Bill looking for the edge on the left side, and Ernie is now the defensive coordinator. And you saw Luke bending over, and Maxwell's going down. Sabino's going to win a national title. You, you were play. there yeah. for that big shot. Really some football. Player. Smith is back. It's an alley, and there's a penalty by a couple of them come flying. Remember that goal line stand there late? Well, the thing that During I do, the return. Illegal block in the back for the return team. 
And Braxton Miller, who's been very busy, shakes a would-be tackler, completes it to Brown, and Brown breaks three tackles. How about that? 181 yards, but now he's up. I should say he's one for 98, but now he's up to 181 on passing the ball here. Second and seven. And that's Hyde for the first down. As Rod Smith has now checked in as the running back for the Buckeyes. Braxton cannot find his initial target on the scramble, and it is incomplete. Even everywhere. Carlos Hyde is back in as the running back. That's it. Receiver Golston in a foot race, and Braxton runs for it. Fumble, but I believe it was down. And the call has been reversed. It wasn't, and it is first down and 10. And Bell battles for a couple. Maxwell has time, rifles it to Lippitt. And that's a first down and play action on first down. Target is covered, scrambles to the right, and he'll hoof it out of bounds. Uh, the Buckeyes are showing a little defensive pressure, but they still rush four. Deflected incomplete. Buckeye defense. Drops it off to Bell. Can Bell get the first down? Cannot. Fourth and very dominated up front. You've got it, my <laughs> friend. Here they come. A dive incomplete. Ball hit. Holding. Defense number seven. So they come up with the play. Good. They got the penalty, got the first down. Now they come right back with the big running back from Columbus, Ohio. And we haven't looked in high school is still his motivation today. Yeah, we talked to, to the young man about that. And uh, it's been going like that. About Maxwell is back, third and three. He's covered, can't find it downfield. Maxwell's not going to run for it either. Buck to go. We're going to attempt this one. Conroy looks like he's got the distance. And it's a one point game. Oh, no, yeah. He works so hard. Down. Every yeah. time you're over there, you find Vladi and uh, great friend of the kickers. That's out of bounds, and that's a penalty. Blackston dancing. Yeah, he's brought down. I see. Carlos Hyde behind him. Jordan Hall's been sidelined here in the second half. Nothing doing for Brown. Braxton throws. Incomplete. And that's Boren. One of the bodyguards along with Williams. And Hill is back deep for the Spartans. Fair catch is the signal at the 21-yard line. Put the game in his hands today. They haven't been able to run. Five and a half minutes to go. It's down a point. Comes in underneath with that first down pass. Short drop. Three step. And oh boy. And the handoff is to down here for the Spartans. Hit on the release. Incomplete. And pressure. Sabino finally, he's just kind of waiting. He's eyeing and King Le'Veon Bell because Bell Smith is back deep. And remember, Devin Smith had the long touchdown catch and run for the Buckeyes. And signals for the fair catch. And Buckeyes with a one-point lead. Handing off to Hyde. Powers back coaching the Buckeyes and trying to hang on. Not going to be easy. Got the first down though, on a tough run by Hyde, who's football background. Here's Miller bursting for the first down, and the Buckeyes. Buller, he's picked up. Miller keeps it. And we go. All right, there comes your third and four now. Hyde's got it. Carlo and Pressel closed the door on the recruitment, and there's your ball start. Offense number 79. Five yards, repeat first down. Through my, my eyes to the back of my skull, talking about what this game meant. He yeah. says, I'm sorry, I bet on baseball. So the Buckeyes are going to stay unbeaten, but it's rough me with that. <laughs>
So there you have it. Urban Meyer.